adios, sun, moon, and rising. Welcome to your Who's Coming Toward You general love readings for December 1st to the 15th. Yes, I know. The background is different. Yes, I normally would work off my laptop, but of course, it's not working. It's, it's, uh, I was trying to correct the sound to make the sound better because I noticed that the um, everything was lagging on it. So I tried to change things around and add this wonderful microphone here, but apparently my laptop couldn't handle it because it's a little bit older. So it kind of, it just messed it up and now I can't hear anything. The speakers don't work at all. So I need a new laptop. Okay, anyway, it's on its way. <sighs> anyway. Mercury is retrograde. <laughs> Love you guys. So anyway, let's get started. Um, Leo, if you don't know your sun, moon, rising, Venus sign, if this doesn't resonate with you, you can check your sun, moon, rising, Venus sign. If you don't know it, check the link below. I can help you with that. Uh, if you want a personal reading with me, go to jenniferwalkerzen.com. Link is below. Or if you want a live reading with me, check out the link below. Okay. Let us get started, Leo. Leo, Leo, Leo. Lots of fire. I like it warm. I like it really warm, Leo. I'm obsessed with you. <laughs> that just didn't sound right. <laughs> Sorry. All right. Um, what's going on, Leo? Summarize and be the signs of their current romantic love life for December 1st to the 15th, 2018. Okay, uh, we got the Princess of Growth, which is the um, Knight of Pentacles. Uh, all their princesses and princes in this deck are knights. So this is the Knight of Pentacles, which is some kind of movement and maybe a potential serious offer or an earth sign coming towards you slowly. Uh, okay, Leo. Tell me what Leo, someone rise the Venus signs blockages for the romantic love life. Show me a card I need to see. Show me a card I need to see. What is their blockage for the romantic love life? Thank you. So there's, God, everyone this month is having choices to be made. So, but interesting enough with this choice, this card in particular, normally, the two of wands there's 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 one choice that's being made but apparently the blockage is somebody wants to make both choices they want both people uh both situations as you can see with this domination so that's blocking the situation because someone wants they don't want to make a choice they, they were like i want both both give me both yes bring them here bring them here both 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 <laughs> uh what is um what is leo summer rising venus sign strength in their romantic love life for december 1st to the 15th show me the card i need to see show me the card i need to see well leo you know this is a perfect card for you because actually this is your card this is your card leo besides the sun card you also are in here aren't you you see leo the lion Strength, strong, proud. You're out there for everyone to see. Yeah, you're in control, baby. It's a very passionate card, too. <laughs> I'm just messing with you. Um, <laughs> what's something from Leo, Summer Rising Venus Science Past, that has affected their current state for their romantic love life for December 1st to the 15th, 2018? Okay, so something maybe to do with an air sign, uh, an air sign person, uh, or it was just more or less someone cutting, wanting to cut something out, or harsh words with the the King of Swords. Uh, basically, uh, this is about using your intelligence, using your head over your heart in a kind of decision. However, in the past position, it actually looks like it probably could be a person. So. So you may, this, this may just be two people here going on. This could be an earth and an uh, air sign person. Okay. Because obviously someone wants to make the choice for both. <laughs> this being the blockage. All right. Um, 
What is, who is, who's coming towards Leo, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus sign for uh, December 1st to the 15th? Thank you. Okay, so the person coming towards you, they're definitely uh, very happy and successful. The card says successful itself. They're very, uh, they're completely emotionally fulfilled, happy, you know, just all around just, just feeling it. Yeah, that's good. It's good to be around happy people. <laughs> All right. Leo, someone rising Venus sign. Tell me what's going to happen in your immediate future that they cannot change that will happen from December 1st to the 15th, 2018. Show me the card I need to see. Show me the card I need to see. Show me the card I need to see. Thank you. So, Leo, someone decided to have both, but someone's not, is not going for that with the four of, of cups. Someone doesn't accept that as an offer. Okay. Someone doesn't want to accept that. All right. What is uh, Leo, someone rising, Venus signs? What is their advice for the person that's coming towards them? Uh, for December 1st to the 15th. Tell me what Leo has to do. What should they do? Give me some advice, please. Thank you. I really appreciate it. Okay. Well, well obviously, you want to use your intuition on this. <laughs> The high priestess. That was so helpful, Spirit. <laughs> Just kidding. So, yeah, Leo, you want to use your intuition on this situation um, moving forward. Uh, let's see. Let's see. All right. What's something about this person coming towards Leo, Summer, Rising, Venus sign that we don't know that we need to know? Show me the card I need to see. Show me the card I need to see for December 1st and 15th. Okay. Okay, so they're adapting to the situation with the five of coins. Okay. Uh, what is Leo, Summer, Rising, Venus, Science, hope for what's going on with the situation for the uh, December 1st to the 15th, 2008? Okay, obviously you want to come out. Hmm. So you're just hoping that basically things turn in your favor with the Wheel of Fortune, that luck is on your side. You want to play the lottery and you just know you're going to win. You just hope things is just going to work out. You're going to hit. You're going to hit the jackpot, Leo. All right. What's the potential outcome for Leo, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus sign for their romantic love life? What's the potential outcome, please? Okay. Well, you made it easy for me. I don't even have to pull one. Uh, you have the... Prince of Cups, which is, as I said before, princes and princesses in this is the Knight of Cups. Holy crap, Leo. This is awesome. Knight in shining armor right here. Someone who's gonna give their whole heart and soul, and there is definitely movement with the with the Knight of Cups. Okay. At the bottom of the deck you have the priest or the hierophant, which is obviously to do with commitment, marriage traditions let's see how this plays out this is getting good all right what do we got going on here someone needs to take a leap of faith to be completely happy okay and we have the knight of wands okay so there needs to be an action to take a leap of faith uh, obviously, this is your card. I think you're the one who needs to take a leap of faith, Leo. Because there's your strength card, and it's a skill card right there. And the lion's looking at me like, really? Really? Page, page of swords, communicate. This. Okay. What's the princess of growth or the knight of knight of pentacles here? What's this knight of pentacles about? Page of wands, baby. Messages or new path and passion. With me potentially an earth sign. Princess of growth. What else do I need to know? Page of cups. What the heck? Okay, <laughs> new path and love and messages of love. Okay, 
One more card, please. Knight of Wands. <laughs> well, there's definitely passion here. Could the Knight of Wands. And uh, the Knight, he could be a little bit of a player. Okay, comes in, goes out, comes in, goes out. But he's between these two, so that could be too bad. You know? Why do we have the two of uh, Wands? Why do we have this guy holding two Wands? What's up with this, please? The Sun card. Whoa, Leo, there you are. <laughs> so, Leo, you or the one that wants to have two. Okay, got it. What else do I need to know about this two? Two, choice. Okay, you want to be victorious in this, so whatever's going on, Leo, hey, man, two heads are better than one. I don't, I don't know what to say. <laughs> okay uh why is the eight of well excuse me why is the eight of strength why is the strength card here for the, the strength why is the strength card here for the strength okay seven of wands uh someone's defending uh being courage you know having having courage uh, being having strength courage and taking control of the situation with the strength card what's going on with the strength card give me another card please 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 five of wands so you're you're fighting with somebody you're 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 definitely taking control of the situation though all right and defending yourself because this this girl uh definitely has the higher ground here and is fending people off and she's willing to use fire if need be because her wand is lit up and no one else's is and uh yeah they're definitely doing some fighting going on here with the five wands why is the king of swords here for the past normally i wouldn't ask for the passes because you guys know your past but let's just see it's just so curious leo because we got two choices here that you want both Okay, let's just see what's going on. There is there another air sign here. Okay, two cards want to come out. Okay, well, whatever went on with this uh, situation, if this was an air sign, if it wasn't, then there was some harsh communication because uh, your strength card came out again, your card came out again, and you were defensive in love. So, with the Knight of Wands. So, why is this person coming towards you, the Ten of Cups? Why is the person coming towards you with the Ten of Cups? King of Cups. So they're definitely feeling you emotionally, uh, Leo. For sure, with the King of Cups. Okay, Queen of Pentacles. So the Queen of Pentacles and the King of Cups. I mean, the King, King of Wands. Okay, I was I was thinking in my head before I, I shuffled actually I was like wondering actually who what all the signs were involved and then this just popped out so Let's just go with it. So Okay, so Looks to me like obviously we have a fire sign here, which would be you We have a water sign here and we have an earth sign here I'm potentially an air sign Hmm. Or this could just represent this person just being emotionally fulfilled and there could just be an air sign and an earth sign. Okay. But definitely, it looks like to me like you're feeling the earth sign a little bit more because this, uh, or excuse me, this earth sign is feeling you a little bit more because this earth sign is like looking down at this king right here. And like he's holding his hands out. You may be a little bit oblivious to it though, because I'm looking at your card, the way you're coming out, and you're kind of like holding your fire, like, yeah, yeah. Mm hmm. <laughs> like that. So this person potentially is really filling you, but you may not be uh, completely aware of it. All right. Why is the Four of Cups here for the immediate outcome?
Okay, we want two cards wanted to come out. Okay. So, okay, so then we got the swords guy again. So, so there's definitely, there's definitely either a water sign involved in this, earth sign, or a sword sign. And the swords person, uh, this king of swords, is something to do with the Hierophant. And I think that they, they want stability and they want something more stable and they that's why they're not really accepting this offer of the two choices because they don't feel like it's a, a stable, long-term kind of thing. Which makes sense why the, the um, Knight of Wands came out, which is someone who's kind of like, you know, going around and <laughs> it's not very a very serious card. Okay. Okay, why did this card have to pop out? All right, we'll talk about it though. Yeah, they they feel like it's unhealthy with the devil card. They feel like there's a sudden up upheaval with the tower card and they're kind of crying over spilled milk. They're just not feeling this. Okay, so why is the high priestess here for the advice? So whoever I'm talking to, this is what you need to know. Okay. Oh, again, this is matching something else. So use your intuition about leaving people in the cold. What else do I need to know about this high priestess? Page of swords. So messages, uh, communication. Use your head when you communicate this, you know. Tell somebody what's going on, you know. Don't just ghost them. <laughs> what else do we have a high priestess here for you guys? Okay. Three of Pentacles. So yeah, it's definitely uh, cutting uh, something else. I would use your intuition, communicating this, and it looks to me like uh, this person that. That's something you don't know that you need to know. Seem like this person's pretty cool with the situation, with the, the two choices that's fine with them. They've adapted to the situation, they don't care. So they're pretty happy because they, they really seem like they're really emotionally fulfilled by you. So, all right, why is the five of coins here? So they're not stuck in their head about it. Why is the five of coins here? Okay, too many cards for you. Like the whole deck just, just popped right out here. All right, oh no, that card was there. Okay, let's reshuffle. So maybe they were in their head about it, but they've adapted to the situation. All right, what's this five of coins about? These are, they've adapted. Uh, you know, this world card represents. Uh, endings or completing or something coming back around or travel so uh it would seem to me like they've adapted to the fact that there is the situation going on and they're they're cool if it ends it begins it doesn't doesn't matter to them they they pretty much out of that phase of being stuck in their head and stuff so what's going on with uh the wheel of fortune for leo So Leo, you just want to hold on. <laughs> you just, you just want to hold on with the four of coins and then the ace of. So you may have already been involved in a relationship with an air sign person. Then this other person came along. And you're like, hey, this is a new opportunity for passion. I wanna, I wanna hold on to this. Okay, why is the Knight of Cups here? Temperance. So the Knight of Cups here is also because there's temperance. So obviously, going forward, they're still going to be the two people. Knight of Cups. So what's up with the other one? Let me see here. And the Four of Wands. Okay, so... Interesting. Okay, so there already could be a serious relationship here with the the Four of Wands. Or the Knight of Cups 
is saying, hey, I'll, I'll be with you and I'll be in this relationship regardless if there's a, you know, something that's not, you know, uh, in balance with the temperance card. Or basically maybe they also could be saying that they're going to wait patiently with the temperance card. Um, but they are pretty much going to be adapted to the situation and they're cool, whatever. So, um, whoever I'm talking to. And it looks like it's going to turn on your favor, Leo, for this situation. Uh, except for that air sign person. The air sign person doesn't seem like they want to go with it. Okay, uh, give me an oracle card for Leo, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus signs for the romantic love life. Give me a little bit more clarity about this, please. Show me if I didn't see. Okay, oh, duh. Deception. Someone is wearing a false mask in this relationship. Okay. Uh, but there is true love here with the true love card. All right, let me just get a card on this. Thinking, what else do I need to know? tower. What else do I need to know about this deception card? Third party. Okay, yeah, duh. Alright. I thought you were going somewhere with this. Okay, well, Leo, if you don't... Okay, so let, let's just play this one more story out here. If it's not you that is the person that has your choices, then it's someone else here potentially could be uh, a nurse sign or a water sign that has um, more than one person and uh, you may not be aware of it they're doing some thinking about it and uh, something sudden is going to happen to break things apart and things will turn out in your favor it looks like in the end anyway with the four of wands the, the knight of cups uh, just be patient with the temperance card Okay, so that's one of two stories there, whoever I'm talking to. Uh, if, it, if it is you, Leo, that has two choices that you want to hold on to both, obviously a sudden shakeup is going to happen with this earth, uh, the, either an earth sign or an air sign person that doesn't want to accept this offer. They're just not interested in, in being in this kind of situation. They want something more tangible and serious and committed with the Hierophant card. So, let me do your finances since we're doing generals. Uh, guys, I also want to say thank you for liking and subscribing to my channel. I really appreciate it. Really, really appreciate it. So, and I, I, say re I do read the comments. All right, what do we got? It is safe for you to receive, Leo. The more you allow yourself to receive, the more resources you have available to share with others. Open your arms to receive and be a conduit for good comings to you through as it blesses the world. And it's such a pretty card too. Actually, it kind of reminds me of like, it actually is a very holiday looking card coming up. So it's cool because we're going into December, right? <laughs> Alrighty, guys. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this. If you did, please like, subscribe, and I hope I was able to answer any of your questions. And I love you guys. And stay tuned. I'm going to be doing the live readings. Just that this whole laptop thing kind of set me back. So either it's going to be tomorrow or it's going to be when the laptop uh, comes in. So I have to see how it's going to play out. But anyway, it's a little bit awkward and wonky to try to do it this way. So anyway, guys. Um, Thank you again. If you like this, please like, subscribe. If you want to press a read, go to my website, jenniferwalkerzen.com, or the link is below. All right, guys.